Hey guys, in this video I'm going to answer a question I got from Ed Eicher online about whether or not it's a good philosophy to avoid training arms and rely on squats and deadlifts to build arm size. Now some of you may be dumbfounded as to why he's actually asking this question. Could it be true that your best bet is to avoid training arms to actually build them? Sounds unlikely, but let me explain where the confusion comes from. Now squats and deadlifts utilize a large proportion of the body's muscle mass to perform them. And when you do that, you get large increases in anabolic hormones like growth hormone and testosterone. So the philosophy is, is that using squats and deadlifts to maximize your testosterone and growth hormone levels will produce far better gains than if you train arms because the arms are such a small amount of muscle mass that they don't produce large increases in testosterone and growth hormone like training legs do, which also involve other muscle groups as well when you're doing squats and deadlifts. Now you can kind of see where uh, that philosophy sort of makes sense. However, as we learn more and more about the way muscle grows, we learn just how little we actually know. However, there's one thing that's becoming more and more clear the more we learn about muscle growth and the more we study in the lab. And it appears that local factors that occur right in the muscle are far more important than what we call those systemic changes, the increase in growth hormone that's actually released from the pituitary gland travels through the blood to get to the muscles. Same with testosterone, released from the testicles, travels in the blood, goes to the muscle where it enhances muscle growth. However, while those hormones are fine and dandy and likely play a large role in building muscle mass, it's really the local factors uh, that play a bigger role. So if you're avoiding arm training, guess what? You're not targeting those local factors that are gonna make a difference in actual arm muscle growth. So no, don't avoid arm training if you want to build your arms. In fact, you might want to increase your arm training frequency, but be careful how you do it. Now really the best way to build your arms is to follow my six weeks to sick arms program. It's guaranteed to produce, I'll say at, at least a half inch muscle growth on the arms. Most people see a good inch after just six weeks of training. And I'm not talking about muscle growth uh, that's temporary. I'm talking about long-term muscle growth. You can ask other Gym Army members who've already followed the Six Weeks to Sick Arms program. So check it out only at gymstepani.com. And guys, keep those questions coming, even if they seem random. There's got to be a reason for the question, and I want to get you an answer. As always, guys, stay Gym Army strong.